My name is Nick Bordelin. I'm the head brewer and co-founder here at 14 Cannons Brewing Company in Westlake Village, California. Uh, we're turning six years old this year. We prefer using Amaretti over other flavoring companies uh, for the simple fact that it's real. It's real fruit uh, in, in every product we use. And for us and our customers, they love seeing the color that's imparted and the taste. Our beer line that we do, we have a Changing Seas is our wheat ale that we have a new flavor quarterly of, and that's what we've transitioned to the craft puree with. Before we were using Amaretti, we were doing what most brewers were doing, just using the generic pureed fruit. It's for our customers that come in asking for a wheat beer or a fruited beer. It's one of our best sellers in the tasting room. And for us, the reason we have stayed with Amaretti is uh, consistency. So our job as brewers is to be as consistent as possible you know, our raw materials change daily. You get different grain, you get different hops with different alpha acids. We do everything we can to keep pH levels in check. So we change our, our brew process every single day uh, to accommodate for our raw materials. And with Amaretti, it's a consistent product that I don't have to worry about changing the brew for. It was really challenging. We were always worried about settleage and kegs um, and bright tanks and the cleaning process was really difficult using uh, fruit purees uh, for so long. And we found that there's no settleage, so we're really, really happy with that. We don't have to do any extra steps in our keg washer like we used to have to do, and that was a really big labor suck. Our yields have definitely improved using the craft puree. We're having to dump a lot less of the pulp and the fruit that settles in, in the bottom of the tanks. So we were getting a couple extra barrels per batch, which is you know a huge difference. There's a significant tank turnover and time saving when we're using craft puree. Uh, it has to be in the tank a lot less longer than using uh, fruit. And also the cleaning process is much, much easier. So we're able to turn our tanks over several days sooner than we would using the fruit puree. We're, we're really happy with the consistency and the ease of use. Boxes and boxes and boxes we used to have to use um, and it's so much more convenient to order in the larger sizes from Amaretti and have one or two large buckets that we can use. One of the things we really enjoy with the craft puree process is experimenting with a lot of flavors and we've been combining flavors a lot and that's a fun team building activity. We get the bartenders involved, we get the whole sales staff involved, the brewers, the seller guys involved uh, to come up with our next blend of the craft puree and to get really, really quick turnaround shipping um, is, is huge. So we actually brew the beer first uh, and then decide with our samples um, what we're gonna mix and blend. Turns out a great batch of beer really quickly. For me, aroma is king. Uh, a lot of the beers that we make here at 14 Cannons are just, I like to say, beers that I like to smell. And the aroma is just unrivaled when we're using the craft puree versus just using a fruit. Uh, we got really comfortable using the craft puree in our line of beers, and we've been working on a side project with a new brand of hard teas and we've transitioned to the beverage infusion uh, line with Amaretti and we're thrilled at how easy that is to use and how uh, we're able to have a new flavor on tap every single week using that. So the turnaround time is really impressive and super easy, user friendly. Our most popular flavor by far has been the passion fruit orange guava. Uh, we, we made it a couple years ago and we were getting daily Instagram comments of when are you bringing this back? Um, so we brought it back and people are really, really happy. So we have to keep that on tap for a while. When we're testing new flavors, we like to first test by the pint and then maybe a growler. We've even done keg trials and that's a really fun way to test it is to put it in a keg and then we find that whatever usage level we like in a keg scales really well to the full tank. The new brand that we're working on is called Chromatic Hard Teas. Uh, that'll be launching soon. It's all the latest and greatest beverage infusions from Amaretti. We did many base trial experiments with different teas and we ended up finding that the Salon tea from Amaretti in the beverage infusion line is the best black tea that we tried. Um, not to name other competitors, but we, we found that that was far and away our favorite tasting tea, favorite smelling tea, uh, and the customer feedback too was uh, agreeing with us. We're really happy that we made the switch again for just consistency. So our job as brewers is to be as consistent as possible and the switch to Amaretti has made that possible and the customer feedback is what's king. 
and it's been hands down. They prefer the flavor, they prefer the color, the aroma uh, to Amaretti. Please stop by 14 Cannons and the proof's in the pudding. So come taste what we're brewing with Amaretti. We're really proud of it and it's doing really well. Uh, so come visit Westlake Village and cheers.